Well, the anticipation is over, and now the big day is here. It's the final of the UEFA Europa League. I'm Derek Ray, and as always on these big occasions, I'm joined for commentary by the former Arsenal and England defender Stuart Robson. We're on the cusp of kickoff. It's Barcelona facing Galatasaray. Well, Derek, this has everything, doesn't it? Two good teams, some top-class players, and a couple of excellent coaches. What a final this should be. This is what we think for Barcelona. Mark and Reiter Stegen starts in goal. Frankie de Jong plays with Sergio Busquets in central midfield. And the main threat in attack today should be Pierre Emerick Aubameyang. Well, here's how it looks for Galatasaray. Well, they're playing in a 4 5 1 formation, which is set up to counter attack at pace. Yes, they'll play with a flat midfield out of possession, but when they win the ball back, they'll break forward really quickly. Let's hope they play it well today. It is the Europa League final, and they are underway. Went in strongly, decisively. Jordi Alba. Now Busquets. Might be onto something with that ball. Depay. Opportunity here. Goal for Barcelona! They take the lead in the final. Are they on the way to lifting the trophy? Well, here we can see it again. He's shown outstanding vision to find the perfect cutback, and he makes no mistake with the finish. He showed a lot of composure there. And back underway. 1-0 it is. And Anholt. Marcao has it. Nelson. Marcao. Might really be able to trouble them here. And a good tackle. Giving them a different option by moving in field. This could level it. He knew he had to make the tackle, and did. Aubameyang. Pedri. Garcia. Aubameyang. And it might be. And there it is! A two-goal cushion now. And just look at these fans. The trophy coming their way, surely.
Well, as you can see here, the build-up is patient, it's precise and penetrative, which opens up the opposition. But I don't think the keeper should be beaten in his near post quite so easily. I thought that was stoppable. Nelson. Marcao has it. And the emphasis is on creativity. She called out. Buffett in Bigomis. Good tackle. Obama Yang. Excellent assessment of the situation at the back. Buffett in Bigomis. Space and time for the cross. And will they be able to play it in behind the defence? And gobbled up with ease by the keeper. Well, as you see, Barcelona haven't had too much of the ball, but they've certainly shown an ability to counter-attack when they win it back. I expect more of the same. I think it's been a really good performance from them so far. De Jong. Opportunity. Oh, a vital interception. Wonderful challenge and a throw-in coming up. Beguni. And a fine tackle. And room to roam for Barca on the wing. And back with Memphis. Going about his defensive business with a minimum of fuss. Well, there is going to be stoppage time, but only the one minute. Buffett in Bigomis. She called out. Well, the first 45 minutes have come and gone here in Catalonia. The quest for Europa League success and the second half of this final is underway. An inability to keep hold of the ball there. Pedri. And Obama Young now. And attempting the through ball. Oh, but just unable to unlock the defence. Obama Yang. Moving forward effectively. Element of risk there, but he's won the ball. Nelson. Gomis using all his defensive acumen to cut it out and the conditions look pretty good for the counter-attack he's going forward well here De Jong Adama Barcelona have given it away
Good pass. Unable to keep the ball. Jordi Alba. Now Busquets. Promising move from Barcelona. Well, he really read that brilliantly. Oh, he's given us away inexplicably. Well, the challenge was clean, but the danger not cleared. Well, just the tackle that was needed. Well, as those stats tell us, Galatasaray have controlled much of the possession, but without really creating enough chances. They've almost passed the ball for the sake of it. They need to start getting it into their front players much quicker to get back into this. Losing possession a bit easily. Now we're inside the final quarter of an hour now. We're getting the ball forward. Really fine initial touch. Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang. And a long way out. Well, he had the measure of it, the goalkeeper. decided that now is the time to go to the bench he's driven in the corner and you need your defender to take charge slip short passing De Jong to pie. Oh, could be so near, but wide. Van Aanholt. Gomis. And space to cross it. Gomis. Through ball attempted, but completely overhit. And running through to the keeper. Pull from the keeper, and they'll come again. Now a decent position. That's a nice looking ball. And the keeper did magnificently. Well, that's just a wonderful save. How did he stop that? Time for a change then. Trying to deliver it accurately. Oh, tremendous work from the keeper to avert the... And there's the whistle. This UEFA Europa League final has been decided. And my goodness, they deserve it. Disappointment on one side, but sheer jubilation on the other. Well, relief and joy, I would say. What a great achievement this is, and so well-deserved, as you mentioned. They were excellent tonight. What a good performance that was. The party can certainly start now. Yes, a party to last throughout the year, I should think.
They're very happy to be celebrating good times in the Europa League. And now the trophy awaits them. Well, these are always great moments for any player. This is the culmination of a great tournament they've had. They fully deserve this victory. Every player played his part tonight. This is what they've wanted. Now it's in their possession. The winners of the UEFA Europa League. Well, wonderful scenes. The players are making the most of this. It's been a great competition for them. Yeah, I think they have every intention of making this last as long as possible. One more trophy left, why not? Yes. And now they get to enjoy the moment with the fans who have made the journey here for the final. Well, they'll be loving this. They really have backed their team throughout this competition. They have a great bond with the players, don't they? That's lovely to see. Yes, it is all about a shared experience. These celebrations will run long into the night.